Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today, from new presentation of cooking with timed recipes from 1924, we're going to be making the clam and celery sandwich. First thing we got to do, steam some clams. Mmm, steamed clams. Then we chop the clams. Then we add chopped celery leaves and mayonnaise. Get that mixed together. And then we put that on the bread. Okay, let's give this clam and celery sandwich a go. It's not bad. Here's the thing. It did say for one sandwich to use four clams. I used two because I made a half sandwich. And I'm starting to think that the bread probably should be thinner, but the combination of clams, mayonnaise, and celery leaves is nice. I do want to plus it up a little though. I'm gonna add a little J.O. Spice, which is kind of like a Old Bay, but a little bit more intense. This is uh, sent in by Nick, thank you, Nick. Okay, let's give this clam and celery sandwich plus up with J.O. Spice a go. So Old Bay has like paprika, cayenne, cloves, cinnamon, all kinds of warm herbs. Uh, and this J.O. version is a little bit more intense than the regular Old Bay. Goes really well with seafood, goes really well with chicken. Um, but in this case, working great with the mayonnaise, working great with the celery uh, leaves and the clams. All right, so the original clam and celery sandwich, it was tasty. It's a good combination of ingredients and it's only three ingredients, clams, mayonnaise, and celery leaves. Um, I'm gonna give that a seven. That's a solid seven. Plus up with the J.O. spice, that's like eight, eight and a half territory. That is delicious. I'm definitely gonna finish that. And I would make this again, and I probably would do it on thinner bread though, or make more filling. <laughs> All right, see you tomorrow.